Welcome back to Jeremy Rewind's Vlogmas edition. I think this is episode eight. I don't know, let's keep it rolling though. Ladies and gentlemen, look at this. What is in the bag today? Oh, we got us some disc games. Let's see what we got. Mercenaries. I remember playing this game when it came out on the Xbox originally. Let me tell you what, this is a fun game. I do remember just donating tons of hours to this thing uh, when I was in college. So much fun. Maybe, maybe you disagree. I don't know. You tell me in the comments below. Uh, I love these Xbox games, how they had all this like data down in the bottom corner telling you like, hey, this is a um, one player and he's 37 blocks, but it's got, this is the cool part, in-game Dolby Digital. Uh, it has other spots they can check in this one. HDTV 480p. 480p. Woo, we are cooking now, babies. So, uh, yes, ton of fun. Can't believe I don't already have this in the collection. Um, kind of hard to see. I can't believe. But if I don't, guess what? I do now. Look at that. Woo! Dropping that. All right, our next game. Oh boy, EA Sports Madden 2003. Oh, and it's not even CIB. Well, I'm sure because I shop at Goodwill so much. I probably already have a, a beautiful copy of this. But if I don't, now I do. And it's sad it's not CIB. Ooh, it's actually broken on top. I definitely need a new case for that. Look at that bad boy. Pending I don't already have it. Um, otherwise, next guy can do with it. But Madden 2003 on the Xbox, number one pro football franchise. Absolutely beautiful. Next we have, ooh, I remember seeing this in the box. When I flipped through and I saw this laying there, first off, I thought I remember this being worth a lot more. I think this is like an $80 to $100 game. Um, it is CIB. Um, and, uh, and I swear, I thought I remember this being a more expensive game, but maybe it was a year ago or two years ago and then it dropped in price. But looking it up recently, I wanna say it's still $80 to $100. I could be off. It's been a month and a half. But anyways, game I definitely didn't have in the collection. A game, if you're going for the full series, you kind of got to buy it. And I picked it up. So I didn't realize, I mean, I picked it up for what was my actual buy cost. Might have been a couple bucks. Uh, but I'm super excited to throw that into the game collection. Uh, and moving on from there, our last disc game. What do we have? Oh, Mech Assault 2 Lone Wolf. And this one, there's both discs and the manual. And I already have this one. Um, I don't know. There are certain games I'm coming to realize that, like when you look online, Marketplace or Macari, or I don't know, you pick it, eBay, Facebook, eBay, uh, what was the other one? I was gonna say Poshmark, or you look online anywhere. There are just some games that are just everywhere. And I get, when I watch some of my YouTubers that I like to, to watch, sometimes they say things that I didn't really think about. Uh, and it's limited run, not the game company, limited run that's making new games uh, of old games or whatever they're doing. I'm talking about where it was a short run game. Like we all know, like little Samson didn't make a lot of copies of those. And who knows how many are still in survival mode because I keep seeing people go in, like I say, Retro Rick's my guy. I've been watching him since the very beginning. He's the, you're the cause of all this, Rick. And, um, you know, and, and see people go in, they're like, oh yeah, this, they were just going to throw it away. It was one of his most recent, probably within the last month or two videos, some guy walked in I was like, yeah, they were just literally going to put all the stuff in the trash. And there was like CIB SNES games, like the cardboard. So anyways, this is one of those games that I'm really kind of going on a rant about because I find it quite frequently. I don't know why I find it quite frequently. I don't know. Is it a really good game or not? You guys tell me. I just don't. I've never played Mech Assault 2. Mech Assault 1, I played 
Part two, I've had probably a dozen copies of this in the last three years. And every copy is a decent copy. It's all clean, all that fun stuff. But I don't know. You tell me down below. Maybe also tell me down below, of all these episodes we've done so far, what's your favorite game I've collected so far from this one lot? Uh, and just let me know down below, and we'll see you guys tomorrow on Vlogmas, whatever the next number is.